Hi and welcome back to Hashtag WT20 Daily. I'm Mandira Lalwani. Caribbean cricket is on a high with both the men's and the women's West Indies teams through to the World 2020 Finals. Simmons sizzled for the West Indies as they chased down a big Kohli-inspired Indian total in the final over. But if you really want to talk about upsets, it's the West Indies women who pulled out their best performance to date to down the final's favourites, New Zealand. Up first though, super sub Lyndon Simmons hands the West Indies this way. Sharma superb early. And there is Rohit Sharma with his first six. Almost catastrophe for Kohli. And that was Chris Gale. Oh my goodness, that's a coat of paint. And that's a coat of paint. No way. <laughs> Rahani, a valuable 40. Absolutely flattened for four. Kohli, just pure class. That gets better. There's the 190. India blasting 192. Big guns, Gale and Samuels failed. The flashing lies behind. This is a simple catch. Charles and a lucky Simmons turn the tables with an onslaught. Take up the stone. I think it is a no ball. The power hitting simply awesome. That is a ridiculous hit. That's colossal. Full toss. Stone. And a no ball. Free hit. Nerves of steel at the finish. Game over! And the West Indies have upset India. You know, halfway in the dressing room, I kept telling the boys, I think they're 10 runs short. And you know, even when we lost Gale, you know, the way Siemens just off the flight, Johnson Charles, the partnership they put, and Russell to come and put in the finishing touch, it's just, I'm really, really happy for the team. The only thing I'm really disappointed about is the two no balls, you know. Uh, other than that, you know, I think the boys tried their best. You know, we scored 193 or over 190, which I felt was a very good score looking at the condition at that point of time. So, you know, other than that, you have to accept the result. But Dhoni wasn't done there. At the post-match press conference, MS showed a great sense of humour in the face of defeat while answering a retirement question. Come here. Let's have some fun. Please come here. Come, come, come. Seriously. Yeah, yeah, come. Okay. Hello, sir. You want me to retire? No, I was, okay. I was going to ask you. Uh, I was hoping it was an Indian media guy, but you know, uh, because I can't really say if you have a brother or a son who can play for India or is a sure. keeper. Yes, true. Uh, do you think I'm unfit? No. Looking at me running? Very fast. Do you think I can survive till the 2019 World Cup? Um, sure, yes, sure. Then you have answered the question. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Uh, you're forgetting something? In the women's semi, an early breakthrough for New Zealand. Big shout. Yes and given. Taylor adding 25. Beautifully played. Hammered through the offside. Goes leg side this time. Finds the fielder. And uh, that's gone. Then Cooper was colossal. Not sure how well she's hit this. Oh, just well enough. Goes down the ground, goes straighter. West Indies scoring 143. No resilience in the White Fern stop order. A bold in. And this is out, it's out, it's taken. McGlashan rallied with Satterweight. And lapped beautifully. That one has been played, but the left hander has taken it to the boundary. New Zealand just not good enough. Easily done by Marissa Aguilera. Restricted to one. And the West Indies will now celebrate. We've been waiting for this like four years now. Oh, not four years, but four times now. So I think it's fantastic to actually be in the final. And, you know, we're really looking forward to it. Yeah, credit to um, the West Indies, the way they came out with the bat and the way Cooper batted. Um, she really took the game away from us. And probably 140 was too much. Um, you know, to chase down, but I thought we could still do it, but we just lost crucial wickets at the top. To social media and it's all West Indies. Former great Brian Lara tweeted, Great, great, great. Well done, Windies. Proud to be West Indian. Current great Chris Gale tweeted, 
Kolkata, here we come. While his captain said, nothing is impossible, the word itself says, I am possible. It's that time. On Instagram, the Twitter mirror shot of Lendl Simmons, who blasted his team to victory just 48 hours after leaving the West Indies, has nearly 15,000 likes. While this West Indies women's victory shot has nearly 8,000 likes. It's all about celebration, as is our OPPO shot of the day. Carlos Brathwaite holds high the hero of the day, Lendl Simmons, in celebration of victory and the reality of a final's birth. How sweet it is! More celebrations as we look behind the scenes and you just can't beat a good victory dance. from both West Indies teams. Join us tomorrow as we look at the best of the world 2020 so far. I'd like to leave you with an entree, so here's a taste of the best catches from the group rounds. Goodbye and see you tomorrow. What a catch then. It's away, oh what a grab! What a catch! Brilliant Joe Root diving to his left. Sunny continues, the leg spinner. It's in the right area, what a catch! What an absolute beauty and cover! In the air, has he got enough? Oh yes he has, what a stunning catch! What an amazing catch on the boundary! Big horse for the Big E. Oh, what a catch! Nathan McCollum. Pulls off a scorching catch. Oh, how brilliant is that? Fortuitous. Nevertheless, Darren Sammy inadvertently palmed it to Marlon Samuels.